That's high, ball one. And that is the second hit batsman of the inning. Two outs, runners at first and second. That will bring up number three, second baseman, Cooper Larson. And we have a courtesy runner, looks like number 16, Austin Taylor, checking in to run the bases. That's down, ball one. Two and oh. Through for a strike, he does count at one and one. That ball's down and dirty for ball two. Counts two and one. Oh, three and one. Thank you. A pie, free pass issued. For Larson, that'll bring up number 10 designated hitter, Ethan Taylor. And with bases loaded, the cannons take a moment to sort things out, make sure everybody's operating from the same sheet of music. And we are back underway with designated hitter Ethan Taylor in the box. That pitch is through for a call to strike one. <laughs> through again. Only two to count. And Haas the third works himself out of a jam to end the inning. And at the end of one, or the middle of one, Port Lane Lumbermen take the field with a one run lead. Thank you. 
And it looks like, judging by the person keeping the scoreboard up here, we also have some fresh squeezed lemonade down there by the beer garden. Perfect way to quench your thirst on this summer night in beautiful Whitefish, Montana. And stepping into the box, leading off the cannons in the bottom of one will be catcher number four, Jamel Chabot. Background ball fielded by second baseman for the 4 3 put out, out number one in the inning. That will bring up second batter, number five, playing third, Hayden Day. That's through, called strike one. Inside pitch, he was counted one and one. Count is one and two on that called strike. Foul well, ball, nothing changes, count remains one and two. That's down, missing, even to count to two and two. Background ball off the pitcher's mitt, recovered nicely by the second baseman for the 4 3 put out, out number two. And that will see third hitter number three, Eli Chabot. Oh. Foul back, strike one. That's way even to count a one and one. <laughs> Foul down the third baseline. Takes the count to one and two. Three straight ground balls hit by the cannon. 